You know, it's about two weeks ago today since I cut these teeth up to go on the inside of the big dial ring. And my thinking right now is that if I sharpen them just very slightly, if I happen to have one that's a little on the extra wide side and it doesn't want to push in well, well, it'll help it to push in well. And for those of you who are watching the spindle series, my neighbor was over this morning. We cut all four spindles to the right length, and he's a happy camper. Well, that makes me happy. Anyway, back to the clock. I've changed to my two-inch wide sanding belt, and the reason being, well, I was just having too much trouble centering the teeth on the one-inch wide. Now, I had originally planned on using my pen press here to, uh, you know, force the, the teeth into the slots. But I'm realizing now that I'm just sort of complicating everything here. I don't need to do that. Let's keep it simple. It'll go about 10 times faster. Let's just uh, give it a whirl here. Use this as a mallet. Because uh, some of them are going to be a little bit hard to get in. Okay, so... Yeah. Okay, do that five more times. Maybe I'll glue these into place first. Some of them are pretty loose, like this one. Just gonna use a drop of CA light. Now I do plan on reinforcing these a little better. I'm just using the CA, I said CA light, I meant CA thin. Okay, I think I better turn on my room air cleaner. In the meantime, we'll uh, see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.